They say a man never really knows himself. Until his freedom's been taken away. I wonder... How well do you know yourself? Instead of expanding our fleets, you've squandered trillions on hunting down has-been rebels like Jim Raynor. Jim Raynor represents a clear and present threat to this dominion. He is an unscrupulous, lawless revolutionary bent on spreading fear and dissension across the sector. He and his ragtag band of miscreants have instigated open rebellion across six separate worlds. And so that's Justice. 
very soon. It ain't over till it's over, you son of a bitch. Adjutant, are my troops ready yet? Your forces are prepared and awaiting your orders, Commander. Uploading tactical data now. Good. About time we kick this revolution into overdrive. Backwater Station is the center of Dominion Logistics on Masara. Destroying Dominion Authority here will cripple Emperor Menk's operations throughout the planet. Adjutant, what do you got for me? Dominion forces have set up a logistics headquarters in the town of Backwater Station. This has become the hub for all operations on Marsara. The Dominion recently pulled troops out of the city and they are now under strength. Are the locals cooperating? The people of Backwater Station are known to be anti-Dominion, but they lack weapons and organization. If I can take that headquarters away from Mengsk, it'll cripple him on this planet. Prep my ship. All right, boys. Let's show the locals they don't need to fear the Dominion. What's up? Sounds like a plan. Commander, there are tutorial videos awaiting your review. Keep your intervals wide, your eyes open, and your ass is covered. Let's move. Sounds like a plan. You can count. Don't go up that road. Tyler, man. You can count on me. Raiders roll. Raider? Kill him! Time to man up. Sounds like a plan. Time to man up. Sounds like a plan. Keep a close watch on your neighbors. Descent will only slow our progress. Commander, destroying the Dominion holoboards will help incite rebellion against the Dominion. Talk to me. I'm getting mighty tired of seeing Meng's face. Blast it. Sounds like a plan. Where is everyone? Raiders roll. You can count on me. Time to man up. My neighbors. My family. This is starting to look ugly. Count on me. Time to man up. Raiders roll. Commander, a large Dominion force is gathering in the center of town. Then it's time to call in that special delivery we talked about. Anna, sounds like a plan. Bring it down. Thanks for the assist. We're with you, Raider. Work hard. Stand proud. We must all sacrifice for the glory of the Dominion. Raiders roll. Talk to me. Sounds like a plan. Time to man up. You can count on me. Raiders roll. Time to man up. Sounds like a plan. Raiders roll. Time to man up. You can count on me. Sounds like a plan. Raiders roll. 
You can count on me. Work hard. Stand proud. We must all sacrifice for the glory of the Dominion. Sounds like a plan. Raiders roll. Time to man up. Your freedoms must be protected. You can count on me. This is bad. You can count on me. Raiders roll. Time to man up. Finally, there's the locals. You'll all be given a meal when you reach the dig site. My brother went off to the mine last week. He disappeared. We got a runner. They're shooting civilians. Move in. Sounds like a plan. Break it down. Count on me. Raiders roll. Things has a lot to pay for. Thank you, Raider. We knew you wouldn't forget us. There's more people still being held up ahead. I'll see to them. In camp. Marshal Raynor. Been a while since we saw you around here. We're with you, Raiders! Time to man up. Sounds like a plan. Time to man up. This is a restricted area. You insurgents are under arrest. We got your back, Raider. Count on me. Time to man up. Sounds like a plan. Raiders roll. Sounds like a plan. I didn't think we could fight them, but we can. Now you've got the weapons and the resources to do it. Remember, Minx can only control you if you let him. Finley. <laughs> nice suit. Pays to be prepared. I heard they put you on ice. Live sentence. What? To give you time off for good behavior? That's right, old buddy. I'm a model citizen now. So to what do I owe the pleasure? Just a friendly business proposition. Do you even know what the Dominion are doing out here? I'm guessing you're about to tell me. Digging up alien artifacts, old buddy. Your boy Minsk has gone crazy for them. But I got a contact that'll pay top dollar for every artifact we 
liberate from the Dominion. I guess I can hardly pass that up now, can I, Tychus? Partners, then. 60-40. 70-30. My way. <laughs> Feels like old times already. Old times. This looks recent. This your doing, Jimmy? Folks in these parts are ready to fight back against Maxx. Guess they just needed a little push. You still take this whole revolution thing pretty serious, then? Everyone needs a hobby, Tychus. Call me curious, but how'd you get out? Well... I busted out of my cryo-freezer while they were transporting me to New Folsom. Oh, I must have killed at least a dozen guards with my bare hands. <laughs> yeah, I've heard this one before. But you left out the part where you walked on water. Made off with the warden's daughter. Don't you get uppity with me, boy. I heard all about you becoming a big-time freedom fighter while I was away. What happened, Jimmy? The war for truth and justice get too much for you. I ain't licked yet, Tychus. And I promise you, Minx is going down, one way or another. This is Donnie Vermillion, live from the UNN Studios on Core Hall. We've got a breaking story for you. Let's go live to our own Kate Lockwell on the fringe world of Marsara. Kate? Thanks, Donnie. Rebel Jim Rayner has reappeared in a big way. He's attacked a Dominion Depot near Backwater Station, seizing weapons and distributing them to the local populace. Kate, I bet the locals are pretty nervous about having a notorious outlaw in their neighborhood. Actually, Donnie, the people I talked to seemed really encouraged thanks, by Kate. the... You heard it here first. Jim Rayner terrorizing the locals on Marsara. When we return, are your kids using skin packs? Keep talking, pal. I'm just getting started. When you don't believe a word I'm singing we can... Thanks to your actions, Masara is now in a state of open revolt against Arturus Minsk. Ex-convict Tychus Findlay has revealed the Dominion came to Masara to excavate an alien artifact. Seizing the artifact will strike another blow against the Dominion, and generate funds from selling it to Finley's mysterious contacts. This old outpost don't look like anything special. Keep your shirt on, son. Dominion engineer's been digging out here for months. See that crane? They're getting ready to move the artifact they found off-world. Well, I'll be damned. See? You gotta have a little more faith, Jimmy. All right. Time to give the Dominion a wake-up call. Let's smash that base and haul that baby out of there. Commander, additional tutorials are available for you to review. Of course. We'll need a lot more Marines before we take on the Dominion outpost. Train them up at the barracks. While we're at it, 
Extra SCVs will help us harvest minerals faster. Train them up at the command center. Not enough minerals. This better be good. Keep your shirt on. Will do. I'm on you want a piece of me, boy. SCV ready. Affirmative. Big job, huh? Go ahead. Armed and ready. Additional supply depots required. Ten four. Orders received. Gangway coming through. Ben. Gonna give me orders? Looking forward. Go, go, go! That's fine. Sure. Outstanding. Yes, sir. SCV ready. Commander, the Dominion is attacking the rebel base to the southwest. Good. That'll keep the Dominion off our backs. Those folks need our help, Tigers. There's no way we're leaving them to rot. SCV ready. What's up? You guys sure are a welcome sight. But we're with you. Just tell us where you want us. Welcome aboard, boys. Bad guys are that away. Go get them! Warning. Dominion Hellions approaching. Of course. Nice job cleaning out that bunker, Jimmy. Between your boys and my skills, we are gonna go a long way together.
Crane controls accessed. Decrypting security overrides. Crane control established. Beautiful. Now let's reel that sucker in and get out of here. this. I heard them Zerg got burned out by them creepy Protoss a few years back. It's been four years and they're still finding burrowed dens out in the wastelands. Well, a trophy like that's gotta fetch a good price on the black market. Up for some hunting, partner? Knock yourself out, Tychus. Me? I've hunted enough Zerg for two lifetimes. to say, Jimmy, you turned into a real impressive fighter. If I was old Minsk, I'd be running scared for me, too. You really mean that, Tychus? Nah, I was just kidding. <laughs> so who's your mysterious buyer, Tychus? Who are we supposed to hand this artifact over to? A bunch of eggheads I ran into called the Mobius Foundation. Mobius? They're a legitimate research group. Why the hell are they talking to you? Soon as your boy Mansk made it illegal to trade in alien goods, they got desperate. And you know me, Jimmy. I am a great patron of the sciences. Thanks for staying with us. Let's go now to Kate Lockwell with an update on Jim Rayner's violent uprising. Thanks, Donnie. Rayner's clearly widening his list of targets. He's attacked a Dominion archaeological dig and possibly seized a dangerous alien artifact. Emperor Mangsk spoke on this subject earlier today. There's no telling what kind of havoc these supposedly innocuous relics might wreak upon our worlds. Anyone found in possession of these items will be dealt with to the fullest extent of the law. Look on the bright side, partner. You're a wanted man either way. Thanks, Tigus. Shocking, Kate. I imagine civilian casualties were high as a result of Rainer's terrorist actions. Actually, the only civilian deaths appear to be collateral damage from overzealous Dominion security forces. Uh, thanks, Kate. You heard it here first. Jim Rayner, killing women and children on Marsara. Oh, man. Didn't the magistrate here know he was hiring an arch criminal as his marshal? <laughs> he was counting on it. Guess my tough guy reputation kept things nice and quiet around here. All the time I wore that badge, I never had to shoot anybody. Well, where's the fun in that? <laughs> 